I'm a 32-year-old English learner who loves watching teen shows. Call them my guilty pleasures, if you will, but they're fun, they're easy to understand, and some of them can be found here on YouTube for free. The first show is called H2O, or Just Add Water. It's an Australian show, so Australian English, and it has three seasons. The premise of the show is that we have three ordinary girls that become mermaids by chance. They have to navigate the world with the notion that even one drop of water can make them become mermaids. They grow tails all of a sudden. So they have their fair share of teenage drama and teenage angst. But the show is very sweet and lighthearted. The friendships are really fun and enjoyable to watch. And the romance is sweet, but it can be a bit childish from an adult standpoint. Their cases are just pecks. <laughs> just tiny pecks. <laughs> Each character has its own distinct personality. And even though I'm 30-something-year-old person, I can relate to their struggles. Okay, uh, I remember how it was being a teenager. And if you add tales to this mix, then it's like a whole new crazy world. The production is fantastic. Their underwater shots are gorgeous. And the actresses did the job really, really well. We have Australian scenery, the ocean, the beaches, oh, the sun. So much fun. If you haven't seen it yet, I highly recommend checking it out. Even though it can seem a bit simple and childish. But for us English learners, simple shows are the best. The second show is called Dance Academy. And it's again Australian English and it has three seasons. The premise of the show is that a girl from the country comes to Sydney and she enrolls in this dance academy, a very prestigious university of sorts, where people are dancing. This show is much more mature, more real than H2O. And I highly recommend you to check it out if you want more drama, like real drama. The relationship are very interesting and sweet and keep you on your toes. And again, as H2O, the set is gorgeous. The previous show, we have more like underwater scenes and the ocean, stuff like that. But here we have Sydney and the cityscape. It's so magnificent. The TV show is shot really well and the actors are doing an amazing job. And there is so much dancing. And it's really rare when a good dancer is also a good actor or vice versa. But here we have really good actors who are awesome dancers and they dance for real. Believe me, if you start watching it, you will binge watch all three seasons in a couple of days. The last TV show is called Degrassi, The Next Generation. And it's a Canadian show. So it's Canadian English. And it has 14 seasons. And all of them are on YouTube. I've seen so many people saying that they grew up with the show. That this show is so nostalgic to them. It reminds them of their childhood. That it's a really nice show, but I haven't seen it. I discovered the show on YouTube just yesterday, and I just want to share with you this finding so that you can check it out. You have 14 seasons to watch. As far as I understand, it's very dramatic. It's more like soap opera-ish. So it's a soap opera for teens. The show portrays a lot of issues that are faced by teenagers in real life. So if you're in the mood for a soap opera for teenagers, then give it a shot. And my question for you is, what is your favorite teen TV show or movie? 
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you really enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time with some awesome language content. Bye!